There you go now fellas, here we go. Got something here from AC Burn and Company. Margaret River, Sauvignon Blanc, Sauvignon. Perfect with seafood in my book. I know, I've been, um, back in the 80s I lived in Sydney for a while and I frequented a, a popular seafood restaurant on, uh, Oh, where was it? South Wharf, I think they call it, towards Belmain. Belmain. Near the underneath the bridge, just around that side. And it was had some beautiful Sauvignon Blancs and I um, whooped into them with the seafood platters a few times. They were about eighty bucks back in the day for two people. And they were fantastic. Big view over the Sydney Harbour. Cheers anyway. I've just um, prepared to cook up a uh, paella. So I thought I'd crack this being seafood and this should go down a treat with the dinner. I drank quite a few uh, beautiful white wines Traveling through Central America, but uh, not from there. From around that area, you're drinking rum and beer, which is alright. I don't mind it, but I really like a nice bottle of wine with a bottle of wine, a couple of quiet wines with a, a nice meal. Just makes an afternoon too. Some of those lunches in Sydney were pretty wild. Two bottles of uh, Sauvignon Blanc. Seafood. And then off on an adventure. I've got to tell you about this story. I went to Sydney with a mate, Colin. And we went out one day and we ended up in the pool contest at Bondi Junction. After a day surfing in Bondi, and my mate had a run in with one of the surfers and ended up knocking him out on the beach. And we fucked off and went to Bondi Junction for the surf, for the pool comp contest. That was pretty awesome. I got knocked out by some shark, but anyway. All I remember is running over everyone's car on the way back to ours, or something like that. I don't know. Got all blurry. Cheers anyway, everyone, enjoy.